in the office. And um, <laughs> everyone always notices the flush. Yep. Uh, <laughs> and when we were uh, on our family vacation together, uh, a bunch of us went to a restaurant in Orlando, and we met a very extraordinary individual named Carl, with a K. Carl is, um, I'm trying to think of sort of the easiest way to kind of describe this, he's like the every gamer. Carl was, is a man who I think sort of very well represents uh, every one of us as gamers. He, he obviously spends a lot of time um, thinking about gaming, uh, where it's going, what it's, where, where it's at right now. He's a big tabletop gamer specifically, and uh, was just an absolutely fascinating, charismatic, interesting person with some really, really neat insight into the video gaming industry and community, and also a Penny Arcade fan, and recognized the uh, first party polo that... Um, that Jeff, our, uh, our sales guy and our producer in our office, was wearing. And so he knew that he was amongst friends and uh, we had a really incredible evening talking with Carl. Plus he can do this really cool trick uh, with his face that I'm hoping we can show you on <laughs> 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 via Skype. Anyway, uh, when we have Carl ready to go. Just, we're ready. Oh, we're Carl. ready. Oh, oh, hey, there's right. Carl. Carl, hi. I know. <laughs> wow, you know, I have to say, I was wondering why you wanted to do video. I totally forgot about the trick. Yeah, <laughs> I, what, let's, so we'll, just, we, we'll save it. No, no, let's not. We'll, no, we'll, we'll save yeah, it. Yeah, we'll, we'll build up to that. I'm hoping that, you know. I had a little bit of lag with the video there for a second. You still with me? Yeah, 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 we're yeah good. you're good. So, hey, Internet, this is Carl. Hi, Carl. Carl. Hi, Hi, Carl. Hi, Carl. Hi, Carl. Yeah. Yeah. You know, someone in the chat was spelling my name with a C, but that, yeah. one of the things about me, I'm very, very particular. It is Carl with a K. Yes. I was named after my mother's two sisters. And very what important. are her two sisters' names, Carl? Karen and Carlotta. That's right. Karen and Carlotta. Yes. She also has two brothers, still named me after the sisters. That's another story. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There, are, there are many Carl-ish members of your family, correct? Yes, 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 yes. Carlotta, Carlette, no, no, we're not getting down the family yeah, okay. tree. We, we won't do the you family know? tree. No, that's... One of the things, oh, by the way, when uh, when Paul was there earlier, I saw him mention the three PlayStation sketch from way back in the day. Yeah. If anyone in the chat has not checked that out, go look at that sketch and wonder at what point Graham stole all of Paul's facial hair. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Carl, do you have a $6 secret that we could share with everybody? Somebody post that link. $6 secret? Yeah. yeah. <sighs> we got to get these $6 secrets in. I, I, you know, and I just sprung it on you. That wasn't very nice of me. Well, let me keep talking and I'll see, if, okay. I'll see if one comes to mind. Okay. All right. Cool. But, you know, I was, I was telling Jeff in an email that you have no idea how much I enjoyed talking to you guys. Like, that was one of my favorite uh, nerd moments working in the restaurant. And our restaurant, you know, we, we have a pretty nice place. Up until then, one of my favorite moments was when Patrick Stewart came into the restaurant oh, and had a reservation cool. under his own name. Wow. And we all thought, oh, like, it can't be Patrick Stewart. No, he just walked in the front door. No, uh, no fanfare, just snuck right in. What? Did you serve him? No, I didn't get a chance to. And the saddest thing was, my friend who was serving him had no idea what the next oh. generation was, hadn't seen any of the X-Men oh, movies, man. and it just it, it made all the guys in the restaurant so angry. <laughs> <laughs> what a waste. Totally exactly. wasted opportunity. But, you know, when we were talking about video games, I was having this uh, discussion with a friend of mine. I think that one of my big things personally is that a lot of people in the industry are really pushing, you know, games as art, which I get. Video games are undeniably art, but I think that in the process, people forget that games are a business. Mm -hmm. Like, I was talking to someone about the Madden games, because, you know, uh, Madden 13 just came out. And it's like, oh, I think it would be so much better if every odd number year they just released a uh, roster update. Every even number year they released the full game which sounds like a great idea, and I think that a lot of people get behind that, but if every year you're going to sell, what, a good three, four million copies easily, 
from their perspective, yeah, it would save it would save consumers some money, but we're in it to make as much money as we can. That's right. And I think that sometimes, as as gamers, we forget how to be smart consumers. And it, it's little things like that that I really wish some people, uh, you know, the average person realized. Yes, that's very true. It's a question for, for video game businesses of taking the bag of money or walking away from the table. <laughs> yeah. And... Uh, yeah, we should understand that a lot of times they are going to take that bag of money. So some people have just joined us. They would like to know who Carl is. Carl is Orlando Carl, my great friend. And he has some really interesting insights into all of the things that we think about. And I spend, I think you spend a lot of time just thinking about games. Is that, that yeah, must be the case because you... I think you, I spend more time thinking about games than playing games. <laughs> <laughs> I think that, you know, it's funny because when I was a, when I was a little kid, I had all the time in the world to play games, but none of the money to actually get games. And I remember being in high school, budgeting my lunch money over like months. It's like, well, if I get $5 a day for lunch and I spend $2 a day today, then I'll have $3 that'll go toward that next video game fund. And now I think that uh, as the, the generation of gamers I grew up with gets older, it's like, look at the top games on the market. They aren't even marketing games for kids anymore because they know kids aren't the ones with the money. <laughs> That's right. That's very true. Yeah, I think Skylanders is the last reasonably, like, really successful game that was actually geared toward kids versus being accessible for kids. I know a lot of but, um, that play Skylanders. Yeah, I, that's a really yeah. good point, and I hadn't really even thought of that. Of like, where's the advertising money in video games going? And I, I think you've got a really good point. Haven't seen a lot, a whole lot of marketing for for the video games. Uh, yeah, Skylanders being really the prominent one we could think about. Uh, Carl, everyone desperately wants to know who's in the cage behind you. <laughs> Oh, that is, uh, that's my chinchilla, Zeph. Oh, oh, oh yay, chinchillas! Yeah. He's, he's asleep. asleep right now. He doesn't wake up until yeah. 6 p.m. Eastern, so yeah. yeah. He's asleep <laughs> all day. Another hour or so. Yeah, fun fact about chinchillas. Chinchillas can jump about two to, th to four times their body length, just straight vertical. So wow. right now he can jump about three feet just straight up on my bed. Cool. Is that is that your six dollar secret car? <laughs> oh, you're you know? chilling. <laughs> <laughs> oh, instead of, uh, instead of a real secret, want me to show you my trick, and that will be my six dollar trick. Because oh I, my I, gosh! I, I, is chat and is the internet ready to see it? Do you think they are? Yeah. Internet, are you ready to see this oh, most yeah. amazing thing that that Orlando Carl can do? <laughs> we gotta, we gotta wait. We gotta, we got You guys have to want it, <laughs> because okay. So I, I, I'll give you a hint. We're sitting there eating dinner, and and our new friend Carl <laughs> comes up and says, "Hey guys, guess what? I can make my cheek whistle like a bird." <laughs> Out of nowhere, he says this to us, and we thought <laughs> we have got to see this. This is. You have to. Yeah, now, not chose. only did we have to see it there, but the internet, you guys need to see this. It is the most incredible thing. So, Carl, we would love to see this. Your amazing trick. Please no, show okay. us. Okay. All right. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> Part of Desert Bus. <laughs> I think we need some donations. Yeah. 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 Incredible. 
then please donate to the children because uh, that is certainly no something that you will not see every day. No. Yes. <laughs> yeah, people are people are just yes. amazed. The at chat that. has caught Only up. in Orlando. <laughs> <laughs> Only in Orlando. That's right. I don't think That's I showed right. you at the time. I can't remember. <laughs> it was it was incredible. We were blown oh, away. Do we have time? Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? That <laughs> Whoa! There. Incredible. Incredible. Ladies and gentlemen, Orlando Carl, the Yay. nicest guy, and Birdmouth. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to. We yeah, need definitely to, a better name. Yeah, we'll have to work on that name yeah. because that's that I thought was definitely worth. Uh, so many. Certainly so many. some some donations Sweeter, for the kids. Yeah. Oh. That was that was <laughs> your six dollar secret is that you are a wizard. <laughs> you are a wizard. Right. Absolutely you know incredible. We we have a, a there's a challenge going on right now that's almost that's only got what fifteen minutes less. What's our what's our current challenge? Do we have a, oh, we it, also no. have a live side yep. auctions are yeah. about to end in and, a minute. Oh yeah, okay. One minute. Yeah. One and minute. We have a live yeah. auction starting in one minute. Yeah exactly. Live. So, so, we got a lot going on. Okay, so much going on. Yeah. So I guess always, I should start driving. Always busy over a desert bus. Okay. Yeah, always busy. Yes, <laughs> yes definitely. Do there's all yeah. kinds of stuff going on. God, I got it. It's all good. So, yes, Bye, Carl, so. thank you so much thank for joining Thanks, us. Carl. Thank you. I really appreciate it. Excellent. Yeah. And, and I'm really glad always that you could take uh, part of your day today. I know you're very busy. <laughs> Almighty <laughs> Carl. Almighty <laughs> Carl. Yay. Yay. Wait, it so is. did we decide that the $6 secret is that he is in fact a wizard? Yes. Yes, yes. 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 he is a wizard.